والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله وعلى آله وأصحابه أجمعين السلام عليكم I am here to represent my wife as everybody knows Ms. Nina and I just want to make a clear statement a clear statement that no child should be taken away from their guardian without the permission of the parents and I want to repeat that no child should be taken away from the guardian without the permission of their parents and whatever we want to do whatever we want to say on the media we cannot justify taking a child that they've been sleeping in for two years straight laying their head down in the same bed away from their parents without the permission or consent from the adoptive parents right and Ms. Nina my wife Nina has all of the legal documents to take care of Musa, right? And as you can see, right, the biological mother even went on to the media to make the ex make a statement to apologize for revealing an agreement of, of Musa's face. And immediately after, what did he do? He revealed the biological mother's full name. How much shame he could bring to the bi Which biological mother wants the whole of Malaysia to know that they gave away their biological child? No mother wants that information to be public. What kind of shame? Why are we approaching this in an unethical way? You know, at the end of the day, you can try your best to hurt anybody, right? But at the end of the day, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is going to reveal the truth. And Allah is going to bring the truth to light, right? But the main thing that we need, we need to focus on right now, there is no need for sulukh. If this was a biological child, and this was a fight between two parents, Bismillah, let's do a sulukh. But in this situation, Nina is the one who breastfed Musa.